Johnson. All right, what is up everybody? Here for another helpful video. Point of this video, you already probably saw on the title, is don't get caught up. Now what I mean by that, I don't know if that's gonna be the whole title yet, but what I mean by that is in supplements. Okay, like, uh, I'm not even dropping names or anything. If you see this, I love you. You know what I'm talking about. Um, but I know a lot of people are like this, like just the mass majority of people who are trying to look better, trying to feel better, trying to build some muscle, trying to lose some fat, that don't really know much about this realm. Like I was taking a supplement, my L-leucine. I'll pop this video up here why uh, you should be taking it, the science-backed evidence on it. So anyway, I was taking this and they were like, Oh, uh, well, you know, what you taking right there? Let me see that. Let me look at it. Let me smell it. Let me, you know what I'm saying? Like, and I could tell that, and I believe this is like the main, and, th and this is the fault of, and on purpose of, and to their happiness that people are like this because that's what this marketed as. All these supplements are going to give you these crazy results. Get on this fat burner. You're going to get shredded. Truth is, you don't need any supplements. Okay, not even a whey protein. That's just good for convenience. Okay, I used to even take whey. I don't even take whey anymore. I'm eating. I do have some supplements I take, but not for any reason like that. It's for health, and that's why I recommend people to take supplements. Okay, but back. I'm gonna come back to this real quick. Backtrack though. Everybody's caught up on this, like taking a fat burner. It might make you lose like the. It's got caffeine in it basically. Okay, it may have something that would. Uh, increase your like that's gonna give you energy so you're gonna do a little bit more so you'd burn a little bit more but it's so negligible what the fat burners are gonna do or now why are the uh, these other things and now why I take the the uh, um, like creatine has been studied and shown to work take that if you want to um I just personally don't this L leucine a certain way to take it before meals has been shown scientifically proven studied I take that that's the kind of stuff you want to take that's actually been studied and I understand not everybody's in the health and fitness and nutrition and everything like I am but that's why I'm here I do the research I do the experimentation and I pump this video out and then y'all can just watch the video without having to go through all that I understand that you know so that's what I'm here for to bridge and try to help people to be that gap between you know what I'm saying you don't have to sit there and read and learn all this stuff um, so don't get caught up on that. I just I just know that's how society is, but that's how it's marketed. People want to just think they can take this supplement, and it just it's in a dream world. Take this supplement, and you can look however you want to look. Take this supplement, you can drop 50 pounds in two weeks. Like if you've been out of shape, you've been gaining fat, whatever, blah blah blah, for 10, 15, 20, or five years, three years, you're not gonna change that in one week, two week, three week, one month, two month three months okay but that doesn't mean you're not gonna see progress in one week two week one month three two month three month four months you're gonna see progress but you're not gonna just get there BAM snap your fingers it's a gradual process everything is in life it's not just you're here one day you take this and BAM you wake up the next day and you're completely different that was the case no there would be no health and fitness industry basically just there just be the supplement industry everybody be taking supplements Everybody will be as lean as they wanted to be, as muscular as they wanted to be, as strong as they want to be, and that'd be it. It would be like nobody would, it wouldn't really, nobody would really much care about having those things because it would just be a dime a dozen, basically. It would just be nothing to have. Um, but here's why I say you should take supplements. So don't get caught up on supplements. Supplements legit may contribute to like a 5% of your total gains, okay? over time i mean like if your whole damn lifting lifetime five percent maybe five percent extra muscle gains five percent extra strength gains and that's great and mike matthews actually a uh, very well studied guy he does like a lot of uh research and stuff that's i think he says it's about around that area and it says it gets more important when you become super advanced where your gains slow down to start taking them then because that can give you that little bit extra and that's when it really starts counting and there are some things that work here and there, but for the most part, don't work. That's not what people click grab onto that. 
I'm about to tell y'all why y'all should watch supplements. Y'all should be taking and why you should be taking them in a second. But people grab onto that as that's what's going to get me the abs. That's what's going to get me the gains. That's what's going to get me strong. That's what's going to make me look sexy. It's not. What's going to make you get what you want is training, your diet, and your rest. It's that simple. Weightlifting or cardio. I always suggest people do weightlifting. If you, you mainly want to do cardio or we'll do cardio more, throw in weightlifting here and there. You, uh, you, there's nothing else on earth that is like weightlifting, okay? It's this been shown the only thing to actually basically reverse aging. You have little caps like shoelaces on the end of shoestrings, like little caps on the end of shoestrings. There's little caps like that on your DNA called uh, telomeres. And I believe they strengthen. I can't believe they shrink or if they linked. I said strengthen. I shrink and lengthen in one word. Uh, I can't. I always get this backwards. Uh, if it's they either shrink or lengthen as we age, I believe they shrink as we age, or I think they lengthen as we age. I don't know. That's not the point. The point is, weightlifting, moderate weights, has been shown to stop and even reverse that process. It's been studied. Cardio doesn't do it. Basically, cardio doesn't do it. I was about to say swimming doesn't do it, running doesn't do it. That's all cardio. You have to be lifting some weights to get that effect okay to remain that extra young get those anti-aging benefits now if you like cardio more like i said but still do weightlifting. it's you can't replace it so that's going to give you your, your you know saying as long as you're progressing correctly in the gym you have a good uh program one of my programs is coming out soon i'll be personal training online as well that'll be diet uh lifting like coaching basically and nutrition so if y'all want help with that you know look out for that in the future um, but you know as long as you have a proper program you're running it correctly you're sticking to a, a good program for a extended period of time you're eating enough calories to grow or you're not eating enough cal you're eating less calories to burn you know saying whatever your goal is and then you're resting enough you know what I'm saying you make sure your body's rest enough where you actually can get in the gym and progress now the reason why you would want to be taking supplements is for your health and what I mean by that is I'll, I'll look up Leroy Colbert I'll pop that up on the screen great example um he's even saying like he lifted he was in his 80s lifted bodybuilder his whole life lifted every other day full body workouts never had any kind of joint pain um he actually owned a supplement shop very big uh com advocate in the supplement game and i am too because there's actually a lot of studies and proof behind supplements like msm great for joint health okay glucosamine great for joint health chondroitin great for joint health and even something called creighton uh, I've been hearing that's really good for joints as well. I hadn't looked into it as much recently, but I will. And uh, gelatin, you can get like or organic gelatin and load up on that. It's very good for your joints. It's been studied. All right, I would already had this video posted, but I wanted to come back. I didn't read down in my notes far enough when I first did this video. Uh, I wanted to come back and put this video in here because do it right or don't do it at all. Um, other supplements I would recommend and that some I actually take myself would be things like which are more herbs it would be like ginseng, foti, go to cola, very good for your brain. Uh, these are very good for anti aging, longevity, anti inflammation, things like that. And herbs like this, a lot of these herbs, and all these are constantly growing, are things that basically the longest living man in the earth that was taken. So I'm basically t taking these herbs and things from his diet. And other things I recommend, like rosemary, which is food, but again, it's very anti carcinogenic very anti-tumor, anti-cancer, anti-inflammatory, longevity producing, and things like sage, turmeric, things like that, supplements like that. You can get the natural forms, you can always also get the tablets forms, as long as it's, uh, the why I like the powders and stuff better is because it's uh, just 100% organic turmeric, or 100% uh, sage, or 100% ginger, just organic ground ginger, or just you get actual ginger root. So. Back to the other video, I just wanted to throw these other things in here, like adaptogens or like nootropics would be good for your brain and things like that. Um, I just didn't want to leave these out, so back to the other video. And that's why you should take um, supplements, aside from like creatine and like the L-leucine and other things that have been actually studied. Um, and honestly, they're not even marketed that much. Creatine and um, the L-leucine isn't really marketed that much. It does say that on it, but like, the pre-workouts get that garbage out of here uh all the fat burners get that garbage out of here again if you want to do a fat burner or something other people who took them who do photo shoots 
who are getting like ridiculously lean that 0.1%, maybe that many people will ever get that lean, like competition stage lean, photo shoot lean. It's not something the mass majority of people, need. 99.9% .9 of people even need to worry about. So don't worry about all that garbage really you can get, you can, I don't want to say get away with, like you're, you could just, you could do absolutely great things with no supplements. But again, I take the L-leucine that's been studied, it's basically going to give me more from my efforts I'm putting in. That's why I'm doing that. Same thing with the creatine. And then, like I said, all these joint supplements, it's for longevity, okay? I want to be lifting my whole life and I want y'all to be lifting, exercising y'all's whole life. You don't want to just get in badass shape for a wedding or for this summer like that's the lamest shit how about okay let's just make a ton of money let's impact the world for just one year uh no how about let's do this for a lifetime okay and then leave something to affect and make a positive effect on the world after you see what i'm saying you want to do things your whole life with anything let's get in a good relationship for just this summer or i just want to be in a great relationship for five years no, you want that for your whole life. Like, gym and life is interconnected. Um, so I want y'all to be able to do this your whole life. And that's why I recommend how y'all take supplements too. Now, like I said, there is a couple that are studied. If y'all have any things y'all are curious about, y'all don't want to research, y'all don't want to do all the reading, all the watching videos, comment down below. I'll do all that for you. Make a video to help you. That's what I'm here for is trying to help y'all on y'all's fitness journey. As I'm on my fitness journey, to a physique of greatness. That's what it's all about here. Me growing and helping y'all grow. Us all growing together. That's what I want this whole page to be about. That's what I keep saying it's about. That's what I've been saying it's about. It's just about everybody growing here. That's what it's about, us helping each other. And that's why this page is here. So that's it. That's the rundown on the supplements. Don't get caught up in that. Don't waste your money. Like I said, if you're tight on money, don't even buy any of it. Now, if I would suggest if you had like the only one supplement to buy it will be joint supplements okay your muscle can grow and stuff but repair and stuff like that right but your joints don't necessarily repair over time unless you're giving it the nutrients it needs to repair and stay young and healthy okay um you can't necessarily rebuild like you can build new tissue in your muscles you don't build new joint you know what I'm saying like uh like fluid and like layers of I forget it, but just like joint, uh, like capsulating and stuff like that. The stuff that encapsulates, like what actually makes up your joint, you don't like ligaments, you know what I'm saying? Like you don't regrow a new ligament. Like when you tear a muscle from your bone, that's like staple it back. You're, you don't just don't grow a damn, you know what I'm saying? Grow back to it. So that's it for the video. Health first here is what I always preach to health first, aesthetic second. I know it's easy to get carried away, or the strength second if you're into that. It's, it's easy to get carried away. And, Oh, get bigger, get bigger, get bigger, string, shong, shong, yeah, 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 you gotta get hardcore with it, but again, it's a long-term approach. You do that too much, too often, you start losing the health benefits, and as your health get grows, goes down, you get injured or something, and then the thing you've been working on, your strength or your muscle, that comes down, because now you can't do anything for a couple months. So that's it for the video, I don't want to keep dragging this on too long. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Really appreciate that. It really helps the channel grow. Shout out to everybody that's been doing that. The channel's been growing freaking great here recently. Um, and I really, really appreciate it from y'all. Like I said, I just want to build a big community here. A huge community of just people just growing together. I'm growing. Y'all growing. We're all just growing, feeding off each other, commenting our experiences, and just helping each other. That's what it's all about. All right, everybody. Peace out. Oh, I want to say, like I always say. Stay happy, stay healthy. Go make y'all some gains. I'm a flex anyway. Even though I got the hoodie on, y'all can't see the muscles necessarily, but I'm a flex anyway. Stay happy, stay healthy. Go make y'all some gains. Peace out. I got eight fitness designs, third link in bio, and I got more coming as always. If you want custom shirts done as well, I do that as well. Um, you can use code YouTube10 site wide to get 10% off.